People ask me all the time, why did you start the Web Yeshiva? I mean, isn't it enough to be able to teach live students sitting right in front of you? And my answer to them is, yes, I mean, it is enough. I mean, teaching Torah is a seminal experience, and it doesn't have a measure or a limit. If you teach one student, or three students, or 30 students, to me, it's all the same. But it seemed to me that there's an opportunity in the offing, that there are a lot of people who are not taking advantage of the learning option in their own lives. They live far away. Their schedules were not uh, appropriate. Uh, they weren't able to find a teacher to their liking. All of these reasons contributed to kind of lackadaisical attitude about Torah learning and therefore about people who were simply not able to figure out how to make the effort to improve in their own learning. And here, I think the critical word is to improve. Because there are people who attend Sheirim in a passive manner. They show up, the Sheir goes on, and they go home. And I assume that they are credited in some way or another in heaven, and that their Olam Haba, their share in the next world, has improved. But it's hard to say that their share of Torah in this world has changed in any appreciable form. Of course, there are people who do prepare, who do review, who are involved, but they seem to be few in number. So with all of these things in mind, on the one hand, people finding that learning was inaccessible to them, either because they lived in the a place where it wasn't accessible or because their schedules didn't allow them to take advantage. And the, on the other hand, the sheirim that were offered were sheirim that generated passiveness, a lackadaisical attitude to the text itself, an interest in results or conclusions or summaries, and they were missing to my mind, the experience of learning Torah in a more serious manner. And since I believe that everybody, no matter what his standard is, and no matter what his background might be, since I believe that everybody has a chilek in Talmud Torah, everybody has a portion in this mitzvah of Talmud Torah, and I mean a serious portion. I don't mean an attendance portion. A serious portion. It seemed to me that the web yeshiva, the notion of learning on the internet, was something that would enable more and more people to involve themselves in this mitzvah of Talmud Torah. Especially people who had decided clearly that their own particular case was hopeless, that there was no way that they could find an effective way to learn Torah uh, in a regular, standard kind of setup. And so, that's the answer to the question. I started the Web Yeshiva because I thought that the people needed it. And thank God, We're finishing our first semester, a lot of people learning Torah, a lot of good things have happened, and we're optimistic that things will get better and better. All the best.